Oh, what's going on, everybody? Here, welcome back to some more Outpath today. Oh, we got a lot of stuff to do. So today, I feel like we've been—I feel like I've been neglecting a core aspect of the game, and I feel like that was the builders, the builders, the collectors, the automation side of the game. I feel like we've been neglecting it, and we haven't been utilizing it to its full potential. So today, we're going to change that. Oh, we're going to change that. Uh, we're going to go through and try to grab all these things because absolutely why not we need all the water things we can get but what do i mean by uh you util not utilizing well we have the ability to make these breakers and they're not very expensive they do get more expensive as we go but they're not very expensive so i think we need to i think we need to go ahead and start making more of them and making them happen so uh let's see hold on a second i'm actually pretty sure i think we <gasps> what's that breaks nearby resources Breaks nearby resources. Breaks nearby resources. <gasps> oh my gosh. We need to get the mining post as well. Um, okay, that's the next thing we're gonna get. <laughs> that's the next thing we're gonna do. Uh, but let's go ahead and let's get some uh let's get some other things going here. So we've got this island here, which is uh is is passively doing all this stuff here, which is super fantastic. And I'm actually trying to decide if I want this to be the passive island or the active island, because we are over here usually collecting stuff. Whereas I'm not over there collecting as much stuff because basically the only thing over there that I need is iron. So I'm actually thinking about moving that over there, staying over here and doing this stuff. Um, but anyways, let's head over here to start with. And uh, we're going to set up some breakers and some collectors. Wait, I can't eat. I, oh, I have no, I have no meat. I've got no meat. That's not good. <laughs> That's not not a great thing, um, but we need to get some we need to get some miners. We need to get some collectors up in here for sure. What do I have for foods? Um, I have cooked fish, right? Yeah, where's my cooked fish at? There we go. We got two of them cooked fish delicious. So I want to go ahead and get some uh, some collectors up in here because these the I mean, they, they can do the things and they can do the stuff. So let's go ahead. And let's get some deforestation. Let's get these guys. Um, so this should be able to hit everything here. And we should be able to get ourselves a collector as well. And basically, the reason I want to load these things up everywhere is because of iron and resources, obviously. So um, let's go ahead. We need to get more. It looks like bricks going. We need to basically get everything going here. So let's go queue up a whole bunch of stuff. Let's also sleep for the night. And maybe if you're enjoying me, leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. That'd be kind of cool. Okay, so what we need is, uh, I need to go in here and let's see. Okay, the things that we actually need for these, since we can't make the other ones yet, um, we need glass, copper, and brick. All right, so we need to go in here. Glass, let's go half of those. Uh, brick, half of those, actually max of those. And copper, max eight. Okay, cool. So let's get those going. And then we also need to get some collectors going as well, which are basically the same things, including stone. But we don't really need to do anything with stone. That's super easy. So um, we'll go ahead and grab these guys. Oh, it's another one of you. Hiya! I don't know when I'll need you, but I might need you for something. Okay, let's see. Do we have anything else for another deforester? We do. We have more bricks. You know what? Let's go throw those on. Let's go throw these on the other island over here. In all honesty, we need the the iron, I think, is probably like the most important thing that we're not getting very much of. Oh, there's another guy over here. And a slime. I gotta take out the slime, because slimes have bones. Did you know that? Did you know that slimes had bones? I had no idea. Okay, so the hottest spots for iron is that one up there. I feel like this spot up here is a pretty good spot for iron as well. Considering there's one right there. So let's grab ourselves another deforester. And then can we grab ourselves another... No, I need six bricks. Oh my gosh, I forgot bricks and everything get so much more expensive. As we go along, it's terrible. Wait, did I, am I not making any bricks here? Like, what's going on? Why is, uh, why are we not making any bricks? Oh, you know what? They don't go to my inventory. They go into the storage crate. Darn it. I always forget that. I was like, wait a second. We're making bricks though. How come we're not getting any? It's because they're not, they're not going over here. <laughs> they don't go to our inventory. Oh, I forgot. Okay. So let's see here. Yeah. Cause before I, like I said, I think before there was a global storage. So it was really nice. Like when you collected sand, 
you would have things back at your base that would automatically start crafting it. Well, that's not really the case anymore. So now you actually have to go around and collect the stuff. Okay, so things are looking pretty good here. Uh, let's see. So I'm trying to remember, I'm trying to make sure that I know glass, copper, and brick, and then iron and brick. Okay, so glass, copper, brick, iron, and brick. So brick is coal, stone, and sand. We actually have a lot of we have quite a bit of sand. We don't actually have quite a bit of coal though. But as as, as we get placed in more of these things, um, the chance of coal and iron and stuff like that's all like the same in the same area. So we'll get go ahead and get those going. Um, I'm thinking. This island is already active. Wait, if I move this, I, I think I already said it is why um, I'm trying to make sure that we're getting enough automated stuff. Maybe we need to automate more stuff on this island so that we have more of the raw resources in order to get everything else. We are at 18.88. You know what? Let's. Uh, oh, the problem is, though, we don't have a collector. So even if I get this, wait, what is this? Auto feeder introduce a food. When you are close, it will feed you automatically. That's kind of cool. So we have this mining post. And we have a collector. Can hold up to nine items. However, we don't have an auto collector that will reach the same 10 meters. You know what I mean? Uh, but let's go ahead and research this. Because why not? And I'm trying to decide where we want to put more miners at. We definitely need more. Uh, I need more brick for sure. So let's go ahead and get brick. Let's max that out. That can do its thing, but we're gonna need, we need more coal and more sand and <laughs> we need all kinds of stuff. Okay, so let's get back up here. Let's see, is there, do we have anything in here? Piece of coal, fantastic. Uh, and let's get another um, uh, deforester miner. Oh, we have the new one, that's right. Oh, three, three gold ingots for that one. Okay, will this one reach? It won't reach all the way over there. Oh, you know what, though? If it was gold, it would. Um, hold on a second. Maybe we throw this one. Hmm. Maybe we throw this one right here. That'll cover most of this. And then, let's see. Can we grab a container for it? Put, like, right next to it? No. Wow. We'll put it right there. Okay. Let's go see if we can get some gold uh, melted up here. And then maybe we can get one of these 10 meter posts. Okay, so gold. Uh, we can make a total of eight. Ooh, that's actually not, not terrible. All right, what was the next thing? It was probably a bigger smell or a bigger, yeah, it's a bigger uh, slayer, okay. So we have an auto feeder. I'm wondering if this might be a bigger collector or what is this? Electrifier, ener energetically charges builds and some resources nearby. Hmm. So that would maybe keep things charged for us? Possibly? I don't know. We want to check it out. Okay. Advanced research table. Allows you to unlock new structures. What? 50,000, holy moly. That's a lot. It seems like, <laughs> that seems like a lot. Oh my gosh. Okay, I want to get three uh, three gold here. We're not getting any gold? Okay, there's one. Two. Three, okay. So let's take this. Let's charge up that, grab this stuff. Let's go ahead and take this guy over to the other island. Okay, so let's see here. If I go into this, deforest this guy. Oh, wow, that's way better. Yes, okay. Build a mining post, fantastic. Can I build a logistics machine? Nope, because I am out of iron. Wow, that's getting stuff all the way down there. Man, jealous. That's super nice. Well, I'm jealous. I'm jealous I can reach so far. Um. The only thing I just we need a collector that can collect it now. All right, so we got some uh, iron. We've got a little bit of gold here. I want to pop over here see if we have any shells because I forgot we do have a. Um, we kind of have some things where we need to get uh, we need to get fifty shells, and they're kind of just like they just kind of randomly pop up over here. So we got to make sure we check this from time to time. Also, we do have gold over here too. 
So I'm thinking it might not be a, a terrible. Yeah, there's a shell. Yes. I mean, we get two, it looks like, first thing. So just nice. But I'm thinking we might need to throw some automation stuff up over here. Uh, take out that. Yes, yeah, so here's some more gold. We need the gold. All right, so we got a tower there. We got one, two, three, four. Uh, let's see. These are getting these are getting more expensive now as we go. Um, so they're actually still not too bad though. Put that there, and let's see. Do we have enough for a logistics? We do. Put that there. Wonderful, wonderful. So that is looking good. Okay, so we've got iron coming in over here, pretty fairly decently, I think. Oh, you know what? This one actually doesn't have collector on it. Ah, oh, missing iron. Okay. Let's see. Let's go ahead and grab these. Let's see how many? Let's see how much we got in here? Um, we have none there. Oh my gosh. Iron ore at eighty-five. 91 let's go this this stuff is amazing okay hold on we got something in here oh there's another three we got a b all right let's go let's go get this smelted oh man this is helping us so much actually we might have enough uh we get all this smelted i think i might i don't think i finished upgrading my tools all right so iron ingot uh max oh my gosh 31 iron, iron ingots maximum bricks and i don't think we can do it more anymore copper because we don't have any coal wow we're actually running out of coal that's crazy so let's pop down into here real fast so we'll grab some of this stuff there's some coal down in here we're gonna need look at all of that delicious coal what are we at 38 again very nice now we could actually turn um we could turn actually turn the wood into coal as well which we might actually end up doing uh we'll see how much wood we actually have here though because if we have some automation collecting wood, how much how much coal? How much wood do we have? We have 421. That's actually not too bad. Uh, you know what though? Let's do this. Let's set up something to. Oh, we could do another mining post, but that's 10 away, and we can't we can't really do anything with that. So let's get. I can't place this right here. Let's see, where's the biggest area for trees? Place it right there. Oh, I need more iron. Okay. That'll get us some more wood going, hopefully. This must be out of charge. Yep. Are you out of charge too? Almost. There's some more wood. Okay, yeah, let's just get some coal. Uh, let's get some coal in here. Let's go ahead and do this. We'll do, um, you know what, max it. Why not? Craft it. We'll get more wood here shortly anyways. Should we go for the electrifier? I feel like we probably should. Uh, energetically charges built and some resources. Let's do it. Let's go for the uh, the energizer because if we have a couple of builds right next to each other, it has a 10 meter radius. That might be worth it in itself because then we won't ever have to come over here and charge it. You know what I mean? That could be a huge, a huge one. Oh, you know what? We were supposed to get a collector for that right there. And I forgot to grab one. Okay, we should be able to grab our collector now. Logistics, collector, boom, right there. Perfect. Okay, we're good. Now, uh, back under general deforestation. So we have glass. Hmm. You know, I'm trying to decide because we're spending more time on this island than the other island. So I'm thinking that maybe we should send the other island as the. Because we're still we are still needing quite a bit of iron for stuff. And we actually, you know what? Now that I think about it, we actually still have a bunch of tools that we need to go ahead and get to iron anyways. So iron axe, iron shovel, iron sword. We need to get those. And then we just unlocked uh, the Energizer. Gold ingot is nine. Energy energetically charges builds and some resources nearby. Ooh, see, that would be nice. Um, you know what? Let's do this. I'm going to go ahead and dismantle that. We're going to go put this on the other island over here. Make this island passive. So that way the iron can be collected while we're gone. Okay, and then let's go ahead and build magic core. Boom. Set passive island. Okay, so this is our passive island now. So this one will stay passive whilst we're gone. So we should be able to go ahead and... Uh, see, that's collecting that one right now. So let's grab this. Oh, there's nothing in there. Yeah, see, it's because I was gone. Nothing in there. Oh, are they empty? Oh, did I have the... I, oh, okay. I thought maybe I had something on. 
Hey, come here, B. Huh. Come here, you little bee. And then let's see, do I have a thing for logistics right here for this guy? I do. Take that. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, uh, we got some more iron. Look at that. We're back up to 22 again. See, these things are going down super quick. Because I'm not over here constantly recharging them. Okay, there we go. Perfect. So this will become the passive island. And it will passively get us uh, some iron. And then we can go back over here. This will be our active island. And then we can... Since I'm, like I said, since I'm basically over here all the time anyways, there's really no reason to not have this as our main island. Okay. Uh, let's see. What else did we unlock here? So we got that. What is this? A vacuum collects all items that dropped nearby items from the floor. 10 meters can hold up to nine. Okay. So this is the upgraded collector. What is this? Collector V2. Oh. This picks, collects all items dropped nearby items from the floor. It gathers items from the floor specified by filters and hold up to nine types of items. I wonder what the difference is here. This just collects everything. Regardless, this has a filter on it. This one, crab shell, dirt, steel, and brick. Okay, so that one might actually be easier for us to obtain. Yeah, because this is like Potion of Sorcery, Scroll of Gather, Emerald, Brick. Okay, not bad. You know, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, this thing collects all items dropped nearby items from the floor. I'm I'm just curious if there's anything that will like actually So we've got we've got some things that are like this. That you have to click on in order to get things out of i wonder if there's any way to get these out of there on their own you know what i mean like so that way they will drop the and that's why i was like well maybe the vacuum will pull them out but it says it still says the same thing it says dropped so i'm not 100 sure how that works yeah i'm not 100 sure how that works so we'll have to try to figure that out uh we're at twenty three thousand. Points. I, you know, I want to do more on the desert, the on, on the desert island over there, but I feel like we're, um, I feel like we're still not there yet, because the points are getting harder and harder to get. <laughs> All right, let's see how much iron, how much more iron we got there. So max out, thirty three more. Uh, yeah. So the island is definitely doing its job right now. It feels fantastic. <laughs> Um, okay, so let's see. Can we go ahead and get any more uh, new tools here? Um, iron axe. All right, let's get that. And we'll go ahead and craft that along. Yay. Okay, and then iron shovel. Oh my gosh, we need more wood. Oh, that's right, because we, we turned all of our wood into... Uh, we turned all of, our, all of our wood into coal. Ooh. Wow, that's like instantaneously mine now. That's That's fantastic. Actually, if I go through and grab these, I bet you we'll have we'll have wood. Oh uh, yeah, we're at 146 now. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab ourselves the iron sword. We'll get that done. Um, let's see the iron. Oh, what does a bones key take? Golden, but wow, that's a lot of bones. Uh, um, and then we need iron shovel is ironing it in wood. We don't need to pin that. We're good. Okay, I'm on the hunt for trees. <laughs> I need so much tree. Actually, you know what? Was there a scroll of trees? Hold on. I didn't even look because you know what? We have some magic stuffs. So let's see a chisel. No, not that. Uh, this. Do we have a scroll harvest? Damages nearby resources. Collects items on the floor and from collectors. Transform nearby creatures into that. Tries to spawn 20 random resources. Instantly finishes 50 crafts of a crafting workbench. Oh, changes the biome of your personal cave to an amber cave. Changes the biome of your personal cave to a slime cave. Jewel ironing it in magic branch for that. 20% chance of doubling gain credits. Oh, uh, yes, please. Definitely need that. Uh, you earn 0.5 credits per second while you are offline up to a maximum of eight hours. Oh, that's actually, um, actually might be handy. Generates 90 credits. Oh, a crab orb. Okay, hold on. We need to get these upgrades. This might be, this might be, uh, this might be helpful here. 
crab orb is glass cactus fruit. Oh my gosh. We can absolutely do that. Um, glass, please. Max 44. Let's go. Uh, heck yeah. That will give us more credits per second too, which is, I mean, we're at 31,000. So like 90 every five seconds is, it doesn't seem like that much, but you know what? Any is better. Okay. We're actually, I think we're good. Are we good on the glass now? Uh, crab or, oh, we need 30. Holy moly. Okay. We'll let that do its thing then. Um, and then earn. Okay. We'll, get, we'll make that too. <laughs> Amber tome, 40% chance of doubling gained credits. Well, hold on a second. There might be, we might have a whole bunch of uh, damages all nearby resources. Okay. I like this lamp with the slime. All right. Give me that bell. And then what is this? You earn one. Oh, paper. What do I need for paper. How much paper do I need? 15. Okay. 15 paper. Let's go. You know, there was a, there's definitely a few upgrades that I think I was missing here. <laughs> so the Amber to wait, what? Where'd my paper go? Did it get sucked up in here? Hey, there it is. Okay, so Amber Tome, 40% chance of gain, getting gained doubled, or 40% chance of doubling gained credits. Uh, yeah, let's go. So that means when I grab, when I get credits, it has a 40% chance of doubling them. What is this next one? Paper, leather, cactus, fruit, and an emerald. Oh, we're almost there for that one. Durasteel and Sand Beetle for that one up to 16 hours oh that's huge um oh let's go grab uh let's go grab this 26 27 we needed 30 perfect that's our crab orb right there oh what let's put in here okay crab orb craft that ta-da okay Oh my gosh, we're getting somewhere. So Durasteel, and we need this Emerald Tome. No, we need this bell because when I'm not playing, <laughs> I might get credits. Durasteel and Sand Beetle. Oh, Durasteel is expensive. 15 Durasteel. So Durasteel is coal, glass, gold, and iron. Okay, so the, the gold is going to be a problem. The gold is definitely going to be the problem. So we need to go to the sand island, start collecting that when we can. Let's go pop over there and check it out real quick. And then we also need, actually, we also need cactus and crap. Like, we need all of this stuff here. Just some cactus fruit. I know we need a bunch of that. But the Durasteel is what I'm worried about because we need, we need gold. You know, some of this stuff, Mound of Sand... We're actually getting bricks from this mound of sand right here. We have like we have the occasion of actually getting bricks from it. I saw that and I was like, wait a second. I was like, are we actually getting brick from this? Uh yeah, we do. We actually have the chance on this like this pinky color ground instead of like the regular. I don't know. Pretty interesting stuff. Oh man, that mining expedition put us up to 54,000 uh little credit deals. So I need to go over here and harvest these guys. Before it gets too late because if I wait too long then uh, they're all gonna run out of juice <laughs> and they're not gonna be able to mine anything like this guy see he's not be able to mine anything because he's, he's got no power I don't remember these having power before either so that's kind of a new thing for me as well do these have power okay so even the tall ones have power so I guess you just have to throw energizers next to all of them in order to keep them all powered all the time interesting Okay, so after that whole little collecting spree, uh, let's see. Oh, we wanted the Durasteel bell. That's right. So I need 15 Durasteel and four, two more sand beetles. So we're going to see how much Durasteel I can even make here. Durasteel max. I can't even make any right now. <laughs> uh, okay, we're making glass. Well, there's a, there's some glass. Okay, so Durasteel. I can make two of those, and it's because of the it's golden glass. So we have iron in there. We have that going in there. Let's go ahead and get, um, let's go ahead and get gold max. Okay. I can get a total of four, four more. We're not going to get this today. Darn it. I was hoping we were going to get this today. There's no way we're going to get this today. Okay. Iron ingot. Uh, let's go ahead and go max again on that. And then let's see, we need, oh my gosh, the Durasteel. It's so expensive. It feels like it is right now. I know eventually it'll probably feel cheap, but yeah, the gold ingots. 
Hmm. Glass, I mean, glass isn't too, too terrible. Actually, speaking of, I need to go through and collect all these and charge these things up and then get, probably get more glass going again. You know, I'm not going to lie. I kind of, I, I kind of miss, um, I kind of miss the global inventory system. Like I said, I could be misremembering this. This, this, that might not even be how it was, but I feel like it was a global system. You didn't actually have to go around. Uh, you, things eventually would collect themselves and you didn't have to worry about it anymore. <laughs> But then again, I could have been playing late game. I don't, I don't know. Okay, so that's that. And then the Emerald Tome, which, uh, yeah, that's going to be, well, paper leather. Actually, that's easier for us to get than, than this thing is right now. So paper, 30 paper, uh, some leather. And what else was it? 30 paper leather, cactus fruit, which we can go over and grab that. Easy peasy. Uh, let's grab some leather. And then let's get some paper. How much paper do we need? 30? All right, so let's get paper. Max is 41. Let's do uh, 30. So we get those going. And then uh, cactus fruit. That was it. We can get the tome going. That'll, that'll be easy enough. Oh my gosh, 70,444. Uh, you know what? Maybe we should go ahead and expand, the, uh, expand our island here. That might help us get some more things faster over here too. Uh, 41,000 for it? Why not? Let's do it. Ooh, that was expensive. Oh, it's over there. Oh, we got another book very nice okay so i need this and we need sand beetles anytime i see a sand beetle we're gonna need a sand beetle any sand beetles oh sand beetle what is this magic items and weapons deal 30 percent more damage oh look at that so there's that's not a sand beetle a sand beetle is like the little there's like a little brown it looks like a like a brown worm that's what i actually need there's one, there's one sand beetle. Got him. They're fast. Oh my gosh, they're fast. I saw them shoot across the thing real fast. I was like, I need him. I need one more. And then, uh, and then that'll be enough for the, that'll meet the sand beetle requirement for the tome, I think. <gasps> there he is. There he is, there he is. Did I get him? <gasps> yes, I did. <laughs> I thought he dipped into the ocean and was gone forever. All right, so I got a, actually I got a whole bunch of beetles as soon as I, I saw one like a whole bunch start spawning I don't know if they, maybe they spawn at night or what but we got a whole bunch of beetles and we got some gold and we got a whole bunch of the cactus fruit So let's see what we've got going on here. Okay, uh, you are oh, I was away I forgot this island is not the passive island anymore We're gonna have to help it along Okay, so we helped that along now Emerald Tome. Are you kidding me? <laughs> did it go in? Wait, where? Where did the other ones go? Did I not craft it? I thought I crafted enough for... There's the paper. How am I missing one leather? I don't know how I'm missing one leather. <laughs> I have no idea. Maybe, maybe I hit the wrong button. Okay, so let's go back into here. Emerald Tome. Craft a 60% chance of doubling gained credits. That sounds really nice. That means most of the time we'll be doubling our gained credits. And then the Durastil Bell, which unfortunately I just need, I need 15, 13 more Durastil. And we just don't have, okay, we can craft two more of those. I mean, I guess I can craft some more gold. So max is 11, so we'll craft that. And then that's still not even gonna be close to enough because it's it's what, it's four per, it's two gold, but four glass. Do we have glass being crafted anymore? So if I go to glass max, 133, holy moly, let's get 66 going instead. <laughs> um, okay, so there's that now. 65,000 credits left. What can we do? So we could, we could unlock the advanced research table. It allows you to unlock new structures. And we actually have the stuff for it. It's 50K. But what kind of new structures are we going to unlock? Is it better to do this or is it better to unlock the island? Um, Let's unlock this. I feel like this is better. And then let's go ahead and see if we can build it. Uh, Let's see. Advanced... Oh, that's a carpentry workbench. Advanced research table. Wait, what? Where's... Wait, where's... Wait, what? 
advanced research table allows you to unlock new oh it's, it's the advanced research table okay so paper 23 paper 27 black bone and 1800 wood 1800 wood are you kidding me how many how many black bones can i even make right now 12 okay well let's craft the 12 black bones um i need 27 of those oh my gosh okay this is gonna be interesting we're gonna have to probably do that next time because that's gonna take a while uh, but we are at eighteen thousand credits right now which is absolutely fantastic and we got some things going which is really nice as well uh we got the we got the new uh the new miner up which is super nice and we got our new uh passive island and yeah we got we got a little, we got a bunch of stuff going we got a lot of things done today but yes that is gonna actually end this episode hopefully you guys enjoyed it. if you did like subscribe all the fun things next episode Oh man, I'm hoping that we come back to some good credits because this, I'm going to tell you, I will tell you right now, this game is a little bit grindier uh, than I remember it being. And uh, yeah, it's definitely taking me a little bit longer to get things going than it did the first time. So uh, I do apologize, but um, it is what it is. And uh, yeah, but I'm having a good time. Still having fun. I want to get all the islands. So like we're at three, I think there's five. Pretty sure there's one, two, three, four, and then five. I think the other one's going to go there, and I think another one's going to go there. Pretty sure that is all of the islands. So we are still, we're still like, I mean, I, halfway maybe? I don't even know if I'd count it halfway. Because like we're at three islands, so that one's going to take a lot of credits. That one's going to take even more. We got a lot of automation to go. We need to get more automation going though, I think is the biggest problem for us. So we're going to continue trying more automation, more things, more stuff, more good times. So uh, yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I will see you in the next one. Bye everybody.